This is the coast of Hudson Bay near Churchill, Manitoba. This is prime polar bear territory. In fact, there's a female having a little sleep on the shore right there. This is where about 10,000 tourists from all over the world come every fall, hoping to get a look at a bear. Most of them packing onto tundra buggies like that one to get out here and see what they find. That buggy that's coming towards us, it's a little bit different. It's a science buggy, and on top of it is a Google Trekker camera. Scientists are using that to basically map out the entire terrain here to see if they can not only just see bears, but actually chart changes to the environment, both on shore and up here on the tundra over time. We drive around and we hopefully witness bears like you have right behind us here. And it's able to record those as we drive around. And that's it. You can see in that orb on the top there, there's uh, several cameras that are all working together to make that street view image. When you look over the longer picture, we've been seeing you know, bears spending increasing time on shore, body conditions declining, and cub survival declining. So it's really just to show people, uh, it's a way of bringing people uh, virtually here. Now this is the second year they've tried it. The first year they weren't all that successful in actually getting pictures of the bears, so Google has changed the algorithm in the camera to be more adept to the bears' movements. Scientists are hoping that if they can do this over consecutive years, they can get a better picture of the effect of climate change both here in the environment and in the bears themselves. Cameron McIntosh, CBC News, near Churchill, Manitoba.